Hey guys, what's going on? We're here today. We're going to be playing some more from 2017 on the good old No Creek map. And today we're going to be chucking some grain, putting some stuff away before winter. So we're going to go ahead and untarp this. So we got to get out and untarp it. Because I think I put it in. Just let me put it in there. Oh well, we'll untarp it from here. Pull in the pit here. We'll get it unloaded. This will probably be fairly short. I'm not sure how long it'll be. We're gonna get it unloaded. Roll over to winter. Maybe do some snow blowing or something today. We'll see. And the one thing is, should I get the? Should I get this Massey Ferguson 9030, the 1300 Challenger, or should I get this Patriot 250, or should I get the Big Bud sprayer? Well, I'll have to get a different sprayer, too. Or should I get... Should I trade this off and get this and not get a sprayer? Or should I get a sprayer and leave it like it is? Or should I get both? Should I get, say, a Patriot and the floater? My... Uh, my thoughts are just get the floater and the Patriot, or the floater and the 9030. Not sure yet. But I did go through, buy some more fields. I am going to buy the entire map. Actually, not the entire. This is as many fields as I'm going to buy. I might buy 15 and 11, or 18. I might buy one of those. But other than that, this is probably the max fields I'll buy. And then, yeah, so we'll go ahead and head home. We gotta feed some cows, and get some stuff ready to go. We'll take this home. I would have, I would have had a video up two days ago. Actually, I will, no matter what. But I would have had it up Saturday. But someone deleted my video. I'm pretty sure it was Farmer Nick, because he'll upload his video and then he'll delete his video and then he'll upload it again. Don't know why he does that, but I guess that's what he does. So. I guess let him be like that. So, we're gonna get another load of corn. Should put a circle around, knock the auger out. There we go. And start the corn. Oh boy, come on. I don't know why it does that. That is so weird about this one. I don't know. Oh, oh, yeah. it pulls the corn out of there. It'll dump it in there. And then it'll just do that. And then it'll suck the grain out of it. I don't know why it does that. That's really weird. Actually, we do have a new auger. There it goes. Now we should be able to start filling it. I'm going to jump in the truck and move it forward and back. I kind of like this trailer, it fills the front, fills where you put the grain, and then it fills the back where you put the grain. It's pretty awesome actually. It fills a little fast though. I mean that right there should be full. But instead that's full. So. Alright, we'll probably leave it because the grain parses are probably... 14 night great. Oh, we can do some trucking in the winter. We do have how many more bushels? 1600 is all. 1600. How much can we fit in the truck? 1400. We have 16. So, yeah, we're in another truckload and a partial. And then we have all our planting and 
ripping equipment because I did go through and rip a few of the new fields I bought. I'm going to try and get them all ripped before winter hits, but I don't think it'll happen. Um, what I'm planning on doing is... Oh. I'm streaming most of this on my channel. A lot of times I will... Like after I get done recording on here, I'm going to do it a lot in like November and December. Once I get rec done recording like on this map, I'll go stream it on stream on the same map on my channel so a few of the streams let me plant like I planted field 23 in the stream um, all that so if you guys want to go check that out go ahead I don't know if I'll have them posted yet but I might so like the one after this will probably be snow blowing or something like that if we get to winter I don't know if we will or not so if you want to go check that out links down below if you want to go get in my Discord server, also links down below. You can chat with me, hang out in the streams and all that. And we do need to buy some more hay. We are out. So we need to get that done. So we'll run over here. Open up the door. We'll probably put it... I don't know where to go put it in this corner. We'll probably just back it in because we are going to drill beans in this tractor. And that really ain't too far away. We will have to feed cows next. So that's one thing we'll have to do. The drill is fairly full. Which is kind of a downside. It's hard to estimate everything we planted. But we planted a good amount of wheat, actually. I went through and bought some fields, plowed them up. And... Yeah, so we got, let's see, that field's growing. See, a lot of the farmers are planting their fields finally. It's like we'll have a canola field of this and that and that. So that'll be nice to have all that. And then these are all our fields, the wheat fields. So we have a good amount of wheat. A lot of them are small. It looks like we have a lot, but a lot of them are really small, actually. So we'll put it this way. I don't think it needs washed. We'll just pull it over here in the shed. Hopefully it'll fit. I'd like to get that shed empty so we can just put hay in it. would be nice. But I don't think all the stuff in there will fit in here. So. Run out of room again. Actually, if we get the semi trailers out of here, we can fit a lot of stuff in there. Just park it right here. So one downside to pull that semi out with the pull the other trailer out. Could stack it better on this side too, I guess. And we'll put this in the other shed. Put it in the big one. And then we can put the oh boy. The razor away. Back it in, we'll put it right here next to these. Always open up course blade, I don't know why. Um, there's the razor. If I could start it, it would help. There we go. We'll put this tanker away back in here where it was. I think we'll get it put away. Maybe not. If we can kink it, we will. Oh, come on. There we go. Probably end up putting the ripper in there, too. Not sure. Put the back of this in there. Back it all the way up in here. We do have a good amount of room. What's missing? Oh, I think our planters are gone. Planters we put in here are gone. That is weird. This is also weird, but that's actually the same thing, isn't it? Oh, and there's a cow thing down there. That's weird. We'll go ahead and shut this door. We could put the chisel in here, I guess. The ripper. I think we'll just pull it in that big shed because we're using it. We're using it fairly often. So I'll go ahead and get this washed up. We do have to feed cows yet. And close the map. Jump out. It. Go ahead and get it unloaded. 
Now I'll give the little stagger a wash. Clean up. There we go, put the power washer away. I think we'll just drive it in here because it's going to suck to back this up. It's a lot easier to back something out of a shed than it is to back it in the shed. There we go, shut the door. And we should be ready for winter. I'm going to run over the cows real quick. Give them some water, turn on the hydrant. If we can run over here. We do have a little manure pile. We do have a mess, pig mess right here. Or not pig mess. I did take the little grass bales and throw them in there. It's pretty cool how you can throw them in there. They just disappear. But uh, as you can see, for the water trough, it is 41%. We got a day and a half left, or day, five hours left. So if you hit R, it opens things, turns it on. Oh, the water animations are off because I didn't move them in. Dang. Oh, well. So now the water trough is full. If you go back over here, the valve shut and it says 100% filled. We got three days on that. So jump over here to the cows. We do need some straw. We're going to jump in the skid steer since we no longer have a loader tractor. I do need to get a payloader. Do I have one in here? We need loaders. I think I do. Yeah, I have a 524K. Um, planning on it, getting a different one. Don't know which one yet will be a fairly good sized one or probably a telehandler the in-game telehandler it's pretty good the telehandlers I like a lot more I don't know why I just like them we'll do the collision we do have to move our mixer on oh, we can't do rations because that's almost up stick one of these bells on top there we go. So yeah, we will have to move that soon. Looks like we're out of silage. I think once we get it unloaded and somewhat leveled out, we'll be able to move it. We'll probably just turn it or put it out there in the grass field, the hayland or wherever. So we'll go ahead and feed these. I don't know if it'll be enough or not. Come on, open up. There we go. So I think we should be able to just drop them. Right here. Change the collision and then you should be able to spear them. And drop the top one off. Ooh, I about had the top one. Here we go. Oh, shoot. Come on now. Alright, so we'll throw the top one in here. I think we have grass, or we have hay. We should have some hay. Yep, base food's full. We just need power food and straw. So that's one good thing. I think we should have enough straw. Well, I don't know yet. We'll see. I'll drive in here. I think we need a little bit more straw. Oh no, straw's fairly full. So only has power food when we get the semi unloaded and the grain. I think I'll just haul all the grain off camera. Or some of it, I don't know. And then we should be able to park this in here. And we do have some small hay bales yet. I think that'll last them a day. And then shut the door so it don't snow in there. And then we're going to speed it up till day one. Real quick here. Ah, oh, there's the winter. Alright, it's snowing right now. Synchronizing shouldn't take too long. Maybe it'll take long. Every time I say it won't take very long, it takes forever. There we go, so it's 9 in the morning. On the old day here. It's not. Is there snow in the forecast? There is. Tomorrow it's gonna snow, huh? And actually, in real life, it's supposed to snow. One to three inches here at my house. I don't think it will, but you never know. We're still uh, cutting beans too, so that's kind of not good for us. There's no snow yet, so we shouldn't have to do anything. Grain prices. 
We're just gonna sell it anyway. Whatever the grain price is. 40. Ooh, it's 20. Wasn't that better? I think it was 14. So we'll go ahead and take this to town. Sell it. We have to sell it anyway. So I don't want to start. Oh, there it started. Alright, so that we don't break an axle. We're gonna swing it over here. Jump the ditch anyway. We're gonna take this to the sell point. We'll sell it. We'll come back. And then. Oh yeah, I think. Oh, there's the snow. I knew snow was coming. So we have a little bit of snow. We got it out just in time before it snowed. It is a little sli slippery. A little slickery out. That's alright, because the snow. This road is already plowed anyway. The county did a good job on that. Should be able to take it to town. I am going 87. It's a little bit unrealistic, but I don't really care. Because if the semi can go the speed, I can handle it. It'll be alright. Except for I'll probably lose it right here at the corner. Ooh. Everything's so slippery. It's kind of cool how they cleared the main road like that. It ain't very deep snow. It's about one layer. Now the ground's frozen, so we can't chisel, so that kind of sucks. Pull in here on tarp. Wish we had a scale, actually, that'd be cool. Get this unloaded. Price will probably deplete some more. Do have some hay and some power food, yeah. There we go, got it unloaded. We'll go ahead and take it back real quick. And we should be good to get some power food. Okay, so we're just rolling back. Our yard is a disaster. This is probably where the trees were at. That's why there's no snow there. So, oh yeah, we'll have to clear a spot now for it. Get that filling. We should be able to hold some of them, most of it. What do we need, like a bucket full of silage? There's only 2,000... Yeah, not even a bucket. Like a little itty bitty bit. While this is filling, we'll go ahead and jump in. Oh, we didn't close that door. Snowed. It's alright. We'll get in our case tractor. Since it's not very deep, I'm going to use the dozer. Actually, it is kind of deep. It didn't snow much, but it seemed to snow a good amount. Alright, so we should be able to pull us out of the shed, kick our lights on, it is 9 in the morning. And then of course all that's going to disappear. It is a little thicker than one layer though. I should be able to just turn it like this, should be able to plow a lot of it out. I think we'll just make a little pile right here. And then we're just going to try and clean, we don't really have to drive over here much. So I'm just going to try and clean out where we do drive. I figure out like the blade on this thing. Cause it doesn't always want to like scoop it all up, if you know what I mean. It doesn't want to scoop it clean very often. We're just gonna pile this in the field actually. So whenever we get pushed out to the field, we'll just push it over the ditch. Should be able to make it. And then after we get to the ditch, we'll lift it up. Make a big old snow pile again, push it all the way up. I don't know, should we clean out? I think I'll clean this all out. Put the blade down, and do some more snow. There we go. See, now it pushes on flat ground, it pushes all the snow out, which is nice. Just pile it up right here, maybe. Just push some of the road ditch. Pile up right here. Not too big of a pile. We'll make it pile up. Then we'll turn around. Looks like that truck is full. We'll run over there, get it unloaded. If we can make it out here. Actually, we should probably should have plowed this first. That's alright. We'll swing out the road. Where is the driveway right there? Alrighty. 
So, get going. Should be able to get most of this unloaded. Probably a quarter of it is all. So, you know, this time the sides filled up and the center didn't fill up. It's really weird how it fills. Should be able to drag it. Drag it in here. And since we sped up time, we we'll might as well check and see. Alright, they're good. That's growing too. I don't think they need any more water, but we'll check. Might as well top it off. And then we should be good to speed up time. I'd like to get a little more straw. It would be nice to have some more straw. But, uh, yeah, it ate all that. Wow, that's a lot of power food. Might as well get the rest of it. Is there more in there? Yep, there's more. 57,000 more. Back in the dozer tractor, we'll start dozing from this side now. Go down the road. Doze down the road. Looks like it's perfect width for this. There's our driveway there. We'll just clean the driveway off. Just push the snow out here a little bit. And I'm going to see how far I can go before this thing gets full. And I can go pretty good ways. Now the reason Seasons Mod and all that disappeared in the fill... That's not something I did. That's something Unit Convert did because snow's not in there. Because it's not there. So we have a pretty good pile. This isn't full. This is probably only like 25%, but it's fairly... It's actually not too heavy. So you can just make like giant piles of snow with this dozer blade. I mean, look at that. It's a big old pile of snow. It's crazy. And we might need to be able... Might need to get that out. I don't know. I'm trying to think. We only might need some straw. I'm not trying to wait till springtime to do it. Just doze out. This area probably should have went the other way. Yeah, we'll go the other way. We'll lift it to where it just barely makes a pile. I guess we just dumped it all out, but I don't know. That's alright. And then we'll swing around. Probably should have just moved the truck. Is it full or not? Yeah, it's full. I think I'll just put that in storage, actually. We'll just doze this real quick. Once we hit this, it should delete some of it. Won't do all of it. It'll fight us like that. Yeah, that snow's bright. If we shut the lights off, it's a little better. Alright, I'm going to try and get in this path right here to push. It's easier. The grass is like dead pretty much. Alright, we're gonna move over. Try and get it in here. It does take forever, but this is a little easier snow removal dozer than most things. There, we'll just pile it right here. Big ol' snow pile. And that's just with one push. That's not even a full push either. So, that should be enough to get it out anyway. We'll get it going. Drop the blade if we can. It's lagging a lot. Is it lagging that bad? Oh, I know. I some all that equipment. I see. Alright, jump into the semi. The other semi. There we go. Should have an easier path to clear. This semi is so powerful that it just chews through the snow anyway. So really you don't need to clean it. Figured I might as well. The next video if it snows more. Because I'm going to speed up time through winter. And then I'm going to get some planting done. While I have some free time. That way hopefully. We'll be able to harvest some stuff. Pretty soon on this map again. And then I'll probably finish this map. Go to a different map. Uh, chances are it's going to be Mills County or County Line. I don't know exactly which one. Or any other map, I guess. Maybe even the other No Creek map. I don't know if that one 
That one's not like fully done yet though. That one's like in beta. So, I guess this is going to be a longer video than I thought. We'll go ahead and... I don't know if... I don't like what those are now. Because we're basically... I'm basically after this video. I'm going to speed up time. And then on my channel, I'm actually going to stream... Um, what was I going to do? Oh, stream plowing. Actually, I don't know if I'll plow. I will probably end up streaming planting time. That's if I get around to it, because I've been making a lot of videos lately. And... Or not talking lately. Not making a lot of videos lately. So, my voice is going to have to get warmed up to that, so I don't know if I'll stream after this one. But if I was, like, planting in the video, then I'd stream on mine planting what I did last time. In fact, I'm doing a harvest series on my so if you guys want to play with me at all, I need at least eight people. It'd be nice if I could get ten people to play. There's only like five or six mods. So if you can, that'd be great. I'm gonna get some silage here. And then you can play with me in my live streams on my channel. And also you could play a little bit on here if I get because I'm gonna make a video about it on this channel I don't know when that'll happen but anyway I hope you guys did enjoy the video if you did hit that like button and we will see you all later